Welcome to another flash cut video and here we are going to demonstrate a fun project where we are going to take a color map of the United States and import it in and separate all the states out and then cut them out and create a nice art project of all the states. So first we're going to start with a color import. So we go import color image and and we browse and take the blank color map here that we found on the internet and there it is and you can see that it imported with all of the lines and then we'll apply the scale here is 27 inches we're going to make this so that it is 55 inches wide And then we'll look at all the different corners here and see if it looks pretty good. It does look good there. So we could have played with the segmentation quality and the color tolerance, but everything looks good there, separated nicely. So we're going to go ahead and check it in. We're going to go ahead and we're going to write the abbreviations on all of the states. And we're going to do that as a mark. So what we do is we go into the text and then let's just uh, go ahead. We're going to say mark element, and we'll start with Texas here. And we'll just put TX for Texas. And check that in. Here's one with all the states already filled out. And let's just take a look here. And again, all the states are being cut out, and then the abbreviations are going to be uh, marked. So now that we have it in CAD and all of the states are abbreviated, we're going to create some nests and cut them out in CAM. So let's bring it in CAM. And right now we have uh, one two foot by two foot sheet. That's our stock size sheet that we have that we're going to be cutting this project out with and we'll cut it out of 14 gauge steel as you can see here uh, and then we're going to use the PowerMax 65 to cut it and we'll use the PowerMax 45 XP in marking mode with Argon to do all the marking so let's go ahead and let's do a nest let's go to the nest feature here and you can see all the states are all here on the right and we're say we're going to just do one one of each, and then let's automatically add work pieces. Therefore, uh, all the states that don't fit on here on this one single sheet will go onto multiple sheets. So let's go ahead and start nesting. Once we've nested all the states, they've all divided into multiple sheets. So you can see we have five different sheets up here. So here's sheet one with a bunch of states, sheet two, three, four, and five. So, and you can also see that some of these are being marked by the PowerMax 45 XP, and some are also going to be cut by the PowerMax 65. So let's go ahead and cut this. So we're on, let's go back to sheet four and we can see all the states there and let's just bring them into CNC and you can see they're all laid out on the sheet here in CNC and then here's all the G code and we're ready to go with both either the PowerMax 65 or the PowerMax 45 XP and all the parameters are there and we should be ready to run
Thank you for watching. Please contact us if you have any further questions or visit us online at flashcutcnc.com.